Hello friends, it's uh, Boris, so let's it's time for a new tutorial on my channel with the Trivela free kick due to a very high request from the chat and from the comment section to see how to perform this free kick perfectly and in this case I will use my Prime Carlos but this will work with any player on the pitch but Carlos will do this perfectly because he has a very good stats here a very high free kick accuracy and a perfect mixture between curve and power and here there are three steps and the first thing you have to do is to see how the goalkeeper stands because if he stands in his default position very often it's just better to use a top spin free kick in that left post but very often no especially if he's a good player he will move towards the middle of the goal and here is where the magic happens and here we're gonna just aim as much as possible to the right side because the ball will curve more than you think but also at the same time it is a bit personal and you have to learn this with your personal free kick taker but with the Carlos he has a great curve you can just use maximum um, width in this aim just as much as possible to the right side and he will still be able to curve it into the goal but if it's a very close range let's say closer than 22 feet then you will have to aim a bit more narrowly because well he will not have the time to curve the ball inside but from a further range out you can just aim as much as possible to the right side or to the left side if he is a right footed player so that was the width of the aim now we come to the height of the aim here we try to stay around one meter underneath the crossbar because the ball will of course travel very fast and also it will rise in its trajectory as we're gonna use high power so aim a bit underneath the crossbar and then we come to step number two which is the power and here we're gonna use high power like we said around the three bars of power and after you power up the reticle will lock in and you won't have to focus anymore on holding that the left hand and your left thumb steadily and now finally we have the last step which is the hardest step and that is to find the Trevela spin on this free kick and here it depends if the player is left or right footed but to curve it like this with the left footed player we just do like this we go with the right stick down and then 180 degree motion to the right side so down and then right and if he's right footed we just do the opposite to the other side so in this case of course we have a left footed player here Carlos and we just go like this uh, down and then right and then after this we just enjoy watching this fantastic trajectory and here you can see some more examples using my Carlos and in all these cases you can see also that his keeper moved from his default position to the middle of the goal which will make it possible here for us to aim in the goalkeeper's corner and use this Trevela free kick technique which is, well just looks absolutely fantastic but if the goalkeeper stands in his default position there are more ways to use this free kick you can also go outside of the wall and do like Carlos did against the France 98 and the same here using the same steps and the same technique exactly and the closer to the goal the more narrowly we have to aim we cannot go maximum to the right side but well this was 25 feet and here with uh, Carlos the great curve we can just go with maximum uh, range here to the right side and finally if we don't want to use topspin and the keeper stands on his default position we can also use this uh, to curve it inside of the wall using again the exactly same technique but we just have to aim here between the wall and the keeper just like this and still trying to stay under the crossbar maybe around one meter and then we just uh, do the same trick and the curve it to the left side in this case and this is something that you can practice in the training ground there's a great practice session in advanced set pieces where you can just practice from all possible angles and also you can hold down R1 which we'll call one extra taker and also if you hold down R1 while doing this you will also take this free kick with the second man taker so R1 to call him short and then just hold down R1 which will make him take the free kick as well and with this you can practice in this mode with both a right and left for the player just to practice and learn this technique and just fully master and understand how this curve works and the same here also of course the further out the further distance from the goal the more we have to aim in the goalkeeper's corner because simply the ball will travel for a longer time and have more time to spin and curve which means we'll in this case have to go more to the left side to hit perfectly in that the right hand side hopefully top pins all right guys that's it for today hope you appreciated this video i'm gonna be back tomorrow with a new episode from the road to glory with my new upgrades in the team 
Of course, after packing Rivaldo moments, we had some crazy opportunities to improve the squad. And you're going to see about these upgrades tomorrow. But thank you so much for watching. As always, you know, until next time, take care.